Oh, shit, like this. <laughs> you see, with bigger gal, yeah, sometimes you might run out of willy, yeah? So, <laughs> like, because they're so thick, you might run out of willy, innit? So then you've got to turn them in different positions. Wait, hold on. That doesn't make sense. How do you run out of willy? So, like, let's say, for example, like, you, you're a slim ting, innit? So I've got bare willy for you. Do you get what I mean? Like, I'd bare. be bare willy for you. Oh, so, okay. like, literally, but if you had, like, about a good five stone on you, mm. the legs got a bit bigger, back off got a bit bigger, might run out of willy. Yeah, but you just move all of that out of the way and then surely it's the same, nah, because, same. Nah, because then the thrust in and that, things will be being blocked. So then what I'd have to do, yeah, I'd have to, like, let's say, for example, yeah, this is one leg of yours, this is another leg of yours, I'd have to put one leg there, then the other leg there, situate myself in the middle, like a sandwich kind of thing, so then I can hit the right spots. So like, but you only really learn these things from like really the research, you get me? You've got to put in the research and then do the on the field, you've got to do the theory and the practical and then you learn your thing. Okay, is it more enjoyable with bigger women? Mm, yeah, because then you can really like hit the spots in that, do you get me? But I've noticed you're a slim gal, like you gal can take it differently. What is that about though? I'm sorry. You know I love you. But love just isn't enough. Remember, gentlemen, the heart is a muscle too. I love you, but only as a Ferrari SF90 Strada. If she likes being on the phone with you, she'll make an exception. Y'all be trying to follow the rules that she comes to you with. A woman will change every rule she had for the man she likes. The man she admires, the man she respects, the man she understands and understands, the man she knows, the man she loves. She changes when he makes that kind of impact. He's right. Now, when a woman is attracted to you, you are her type. She cherishes, respects, and admires you. She's going to make getting to know her easier. She's even going to let you take her on an ice cream date, a walk in the park, a coffee date. And even if you live in a cardboard or under the bridge, she doesn't care because all she wants to do is get to know you better. But when a woman is not interested in you, she's not attracted to you, you're not her type, then she's going to make you as a man jump through hoops by buying her expensive gifts, taking on expensive dates or expensive trips. She's going to make you wait 90 days or more before you can get into her sweet water regards because she doesn't like you. She's not interested in you, but she's like, hey, I might as well get something. And remember, gentlemen, alpha seed, better need. And don't pay for something that another man got for free. If she plays hard to get, she doesn't like you because nobody wants to play too long. Like mind games and like make you think that like, she wants you and then just wants you and then you get stuck in her trap. Oh, she wants me then. That's literally <laughs> She do is. wants you. That's really what it is? Yeah, that's really what yeah. it is. Because nobody okay. wants to play too long if they really like you. She might be trying to see what she can get out of you, but people who like you show it. You smart. The reason why I knew I needed to get a divorce was because I have a crystal clear memory of me having s with my husband and thinking about this other guy. Why? And me knowing in that moment I have to divorce him because if I don't get I've out of this marriage, before. I'm going to cheat on him. I'm going to try to find this. That's and I know that's really f***ed up, but I didn't want to be no, a cheater. No, it's not. It's not. That's happened to me too. It's an evil world we live in. We can go to the restaurant right now because I've been checking you out all night. No. So you say you'll smash right now. <laughs> I'm like... <laughs> yeah, eat that bitch up. You ain't gonna eat that bitch up in the bathroom. Hold on. Yo, yo, come on, yo. Tag it, tag it. This place closed like five years ago. <laughs> Women. <laughs> Would you rather be stuck in a forest with a woman or a dog? A dog. 
Oh, a dog? Definitely a dog. I'll take a dog. A dog. <laughs> a dog. Dog. All the time, man. I sit there stroking him. What's your sign? Same. We're the same sign. I definitely can never. Pisces, You're very beautiful. What's your sign? What's my sign? Yeah. Uh, I'm a Capricorn. I can never. What's your sign? Yeah. I can never. What's your sign? I'm an alien. Walk away from me. What's your sign? I can never. What's your sign? I'm an I can never. What's your sign? I'm a Libra. I can never. What's your sign? What's your sign? I'm an Aries. Oh, I can never walk away from you. What's your sign? Gemini. <laughs> I can never. Oh! What's your sign? Oh, I can never walk away from you. Very beautiful. What's your sign? I'm a Leo. Leo? What's your sign? I'm a Taurus. What's your sign? I'm a Capricorn. I can never. I can never. He lied. He must lie. You can get me the strongest man possible. I will tell you the best way to bring him down is to guilt him. Yeah. All right. I'll see you later. Me nice to meet you. Jesus can't save these hoes. Why are you trying?